So what is going on guys, it is your boy Knight of the Game here and today we do have um, well a bit of an, an announcement, last episode I said if we um, do uh, like uh, in the 10th match we're still in the top 3 then I will put it up but oh that's good, um, 75 right okay so um Right, okay, so we'll adjust the budget for that, please. Um, so, um, basically, we are trying to get Bryn Morris, um, purely because we do just need the new centre mid. Um, right, okay, so we're going to have him for five years, so, and then um, squad a squad rotation player, so that would be a good signing if we can get it done. But now we do have Newcastle, and um, I am wait. We're gonna simulate it just because, like, um, it's a cup. I'm not really focusing on a particular cup. So if we can win, it's very good. But Henderson is playing, but we do win two 0 So is it the squad or? Uh, I'm just getting amazing luck here by the teams that they're picking against us, but. Um, so, Champions Cup. Olympic four. so he prayed, um, okay, so, one. is there any, like, like Rovers, two. no, yeah, um, one. Oh, go on. kit numbers, there we go, so I am one. changing the kit numbers, so, Blackman is now a from seven and four. His original number he is now. Um, Denon Lewis was a, um, ten, I think. He should be then five and nine. And then, so that's better. Um, I'm liking the numbers, but then I do want him to be number twenty. And then, Gural, I do think he's going to be like Madison, so. Number 36, Garrell is, and there we go, so some new numbers, but now we can really focus on other things than matches. So now if we go into Garrell, we will try, try and get him to around a 70 yard, um, but if we can get him more, that's brilliant. But um, Kazira is going up quite a lot. Hadler, maybe that's his time up for growing for a long time, but you never know. Um, so now, have we signed him? Final scout report, okay. Um, how good, 80 rated, yes, we were definitely going to get him. Oh, Ben Morris has accepted that, which is good news. Deadline day signing. We have confirmed Bryn Morris is now a Coventry City player. So, a new midfield sign midfield signing and 65 rated like i was expecting for what they were saying a, a bit more but you know um still in my opinion a great player and a great prospect but now Garrell is actually going to play further up the pitch than he normally will and um it, like he's normally a centre mid but then we've got two sentiments there that will that aren't being challenged at the moment. But actually, if we put Brim Morris there to make his debut, there we go. So um, Brim Morris coming in for um, Denon, uh, oh, Denon Lewis, sorry. Um, but hopefully we can sell someone now and and get some money. So. Gil Martin actually. Um, so now Aston Villa, I can't wait to play them. But oh, they've just signed this Patricia. Um, Rube, oh, the the goalkeeper one. Okay. So um, we'll get um, yes, offer for Jim O'Brien. We are going to accept that. That is over his like transfer budget estimated worth, whatever you want to. It, well, no transfer value actually. So it is sold by one hour, which is quite good. Hopefully, we can um, now... I 
I don't think we're gonna um, get him, are we? Well, not selling as a player, like you know. What I mean? Why aren't Why aren't they giving me the money? I need the money, 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 money. Wait, how much did we spend? Sixteen million. Okay, so for a new team up, that is good. And well, <laughs> that's funny. Um, some teams have spent nothing, but. There we go, um, transfer deadline day has ended, so the transfer window is over, but of course you can still get people on a free transfer, which is what I will try to be doing now, and you're probably wondering, you, you're in, it's not, you don't do that anymore, you're in the Premier League, but one thing we do still want is new players coming in, so Billy Chambers, Maybe a good prospect for the future. Um, so we're going to put him on future first team players. So we don't know if he's going to be that good or if he's going to, or if he's going to be amazing like Stephen Gerrard. But um, so so um um right okay. So we probably do need the new um like centre back maybe a young cent yes centre back there we go so um 350 that's what they want and then future first team player so um guys there won't actually be a a match in this they'll just be simulated games because um like well we might play one match Wait, no we won't. And um, we'll just simulate. Ah, oh, we've got a game in hand and we're top of the league. So that proves that we are very good. And, well, they've left the last three. So if we don't win this, I will be sad. <sighs> yeah, we've lost against Hull City. I might start simulating games now. Probably could then the Lewis wasn't playing. If it is though, that proves how much we do need him. But um, there we go. So two new players coming in. Um, so let's see their overall chamber right there. Them to look half decent now. Right, yes, you're going to come in there and then there and then you go there and then gentle route. There we go. That is good. Right, there we go. My eye button just like looks like more in than the others, but like I pulled it out. Like not fully, just like well, you know what I mean. Um, so now I just really don't know who to like get. Like, should I wait and then save that budget up? I'm not gonna do training for quite a while, so Egypt. No, I don't want to manage Egypt. I just don't. Don't take me to that. Right, okay, so. God. Right, okay. Everton. Now, should we play this? Is it home? Yes. I think um, we are. Wait, where are we in the league? So, we've got a game in hand though. So, if we win this, we can go tough. But what's the goal difference? We've got the best in the league, so if we win, we'll go top. But if we lose, then we'll stay. Well, we'll lose a place. So this is very important, and hopefully, it isn't too hard because we're on um uh world class. But I will see you at the end of the match. Peace, guys. So on legend, no world class. We did lose and. Well, this was their goal. This was their first chance, real chance. And I was like fuming. Then Bojan missed here. Yeah. Um, then I thought Chris Stokes. Yes, look at this. Intercepts, and that's what you get to do. But not this. Look, I don't. I don't know how. I did. I could deal with this though. How could I deal with an overhead kick like that? All credit to Ross Barkley though, but you know, 
do we go back to um because literally that was so hard i i just couldn't deal with it so as you can see we are now seven so but you know so if we go back to settings we will we do unprofessional as like we just can't deal with that but th now this is a good match but i will leave that until next episode peace